we are looking here at a 2024 RAV4 XSE Hybrid. XSE has been one of my favorite trims from Toyota ever since they first released it. On this one, you've got that black roof, black wheels, and a cool blue stitching on the interior to go along with that sportier, high-end look. One thing Toyota does throughout their hybrid series is they put the blue on the logo there. That's how you know it's a hybrid. This one has some cameras around the vehicle that ties in to the top-down view camera system. You also have uh, parking sensors there, and then these cool um, fog lights as well. Taking a closer look here at the black wheels. I like with the two-tone, so they do this rocker panel a different color. You can see the roof is black, ties in, sunroof there, black badging. You can see here on the all-wheel drive logo. And then that two-tone blacked out badging kind of carries out throughout the whole vehicle here. Let's take a look inside and see what we've got. Looking at the door here to start with, power windows, power mirrors, power locks, and then two driver settings there. You can see, of course, power adjustable driver's seat. And then there is that blue stitching that I was talking about on the interior. We've got a bunch of cool stuff here, including a heated steering wheel, and that's a view button for our cameras. We're gonna look at that. Dimmer for the lights, auto headlights. So Toyota Safety Sense is something they're doing on all of the new RAV4s. That's gonna include your auto headlights. And then looking at the steering wheel here, it's also gonna include your adaptive cruise control there and your lane departure assist among other features. This here views for the camera. Let's look at that. So taking a look at our center screen here. Oh, that's really cool. It's actually spinning around. Checking your surrounding for safeties. Now as a dad, that'd be something I'd like to have. There's our top down there. Pretty neat. Um, I'm gonna pop us into reverse here. You can see we've got our backup camera and then it automatically goes to our top down there. Now I can hit this button as well. It's gonna change to just our backup camera. And hitting this one, it's gonna let me change what our lines look like there. So there's just the red line. And let me tell you, that red line, you do not want to go past it. Go. So moving back over here, our digital display. So those uh, analog style clusters are all digital, and then this screen can be customized, um, at least semi-customized to your liking. So you can see the info that you want to see and kind of set that up the way you like it. Automatic headlights here, and then your window adjusters there for your windshield vipers. Taking a look here, dual zone climate. We already looked a little bit at the uh, digital display here. We will need to set up the Toyota app, activate your connected services to get the most out of the screen. Um, but you can see nice, big, clear, easy to read, easy to use. JBL badging, so you do have your premium JBL audio in here as well. But going back down here, um, I want to point out the blue stitching is kind of a theme that carries throughout a lot of the vehicle, so that's kind of cool. We do have heated seats, dual zone climate, automatic transmission, of course. Here, park, reverse, neutral, drive, and then we can shift over to sport mode from sport. You can see it automatically puts us in third gear. We can shift all the way up to sixth or all the way down to first gear there. B 
beyond that, going back down here, we have your park brake and then your ability to hold your park brake. And then we have our mode selector here. Uh, being a hybrid, we do actually have an EV mode built in. Looks like it's too cold for me to activate that right now. EV mode unavailable. It is, you know, what, February here in Montana. Uh, nice chilly morning, so I can understand why uh, EV mode's not gonna activate, especially since I have defrost running. Uh, normal mode, that's gonna be your default driving. You also have trail. So you can see that there. Eco, that's gonna be what you use to get the most fuel economy out of your vehicle. And then sport, I like that it turns red, like it's a warning. Are you ready to go fast? Cause you're in sport mode, that's kind of fun. Um, this trail there, and then normal right there. Let's swing around, I want to look at the back seat. And then we can see we've got our sunroof right up there in our rear view mirror we do have garage door openers built in so that's kind of nice your standard sunglass holder your SOS so something that I think is kind of cool that Toyota does there's actually like a safety um, hatch there pop that open and now you could really hit the SOS button if you wanted to Taking a look at the back seat, one thing I want to point out is you do have your all-weather mats in here. Now, something I always like to do, I've got that front seat in my own personal driving position. You can see what the space looks like there. Now we're going to see what my space looks like back here. Plenty of room for my legs. Flipping around, really good headspace, like really good. So that's pretty awesome. I think uh, full-grown adult passengers are going to be very comfortable back here. Um, kids are gonna have all kinds of space, which this is not the biggest SUV, so that's pretty cool to see. Let's take a look at the seat. So we have a release here that folds down. You have these nice rubberized mats. It's actually pretty flat. There's a little bit of an incline here, but otherwise looks pretty flat. Let's take a look at seat number two. Folds down the same way. There's our automatic gate there. Let's take a look. So more of that premium audio system from JBL. It's pretty good space back here. Pretty roomy, you could do a lot with that. Let's look under here. You know, the old RAV4 always had a tire on the back. I'm glad to see that we still have a real spare tire in this latest version. Uh, then something else I wanna show you is right here, what that is for is you can remove this cover here, and then it stores right under the floorboards for you. This car is available at the time of posting this video. So if you're watching, my contact info is in the description. Please check it out. Give me a call, set up a time. Let's check it out. It's here, ready, and waiting for you. Appreciate you watching. Thanks.